child, but I had a question. Mama, what if I were a big scary ape? Would you still love me then? If you were a big scary ape, I would make your birthday cake out of bananas, and I would tell you I love you, my big scary ape. But Mama, what if I were a super smelly skunk and I smelled so bad that my name was Stinky Face? And I'd plunk you in a bubble bath, but if you still smelled stinky, I wouldn't mind. I'd whisper in your ear, I love you, Stinky Face. But Mama, what if I were an alligator with big sharp teeth? I would buy you a bigger toothbrush. And we're not going to read the book right now because Adelaide's finished. <laughs> Are you done? But what if I were a terrible meat-eating dinosaur? Let me see. I would make you a mountain of hamburgers and say, I love you, my terrible sweet dinosaur. Urgh. What if I were a big swamp creature that were slimy and smelly? What happens then? I would be, I would live by the swamp and take care of you. I'd always tell you, I love you, my slimy swamp monster. But Mama, what if I were a green alien from Mars and I ate bugs instead of peanut butter? Then I would make you a sandwich with bugs. But what if I were a one-eyed monster? <laughs> You're going to turn, help turn the page? Okay. Then I would say I love you and I would rock you until your one droopy eye fell asleep. And that's the end. Who is that? Is that the Mama? Are you gonna read? There's the big dinosaur. There's a slimy swamp creature. There's stinky face. Stinky face. Alligator. Alligator. Dinosaur. Alligator. Dinosaur. Alligator. <laughs> and we're done.